American Mahjong is a complex game, and for many players, picking a hand is easier said than done. In the first video in the series of how to pick a hand, we did random pulls to demonstrate how to find the strength in a dealt hand. In the second video of the series, we did Charleston modeling to demonstrate how to pick a hand three ways. In this video, we're going to bring the efforts together in a game of solitaire and demonstrate how to pick a hand three ways from beginning to end. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way, we'll be able to track the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. Since most players have a preferred style of play, let's assign a style to each player in advance. We'll have East play fixed. So they are going to pick a hand from the onset. We'll have South play adaptive. They are going to pick a category to play or more one or more categories and they will pick a hand when they run out of discards. We'll have West do the same thing, adaptive. And then we'll have North play a hybrid. They are going to be adaptive through the Charleston and then they'll pick a hand after the Charleston and stick with a hand until they either win or have to switch to something else if the hand doesn't work out. So we're going to do fixed, two adaptive and a hybrid. Everybody has their tiles. Let's look and see what we can do for East. They have news and there's news all over this card. Every category but addition and quince. So let's see what we have here that we can play. We've got a couple of dragons and there is a news dragon hand but we have singles and no white dragon. That would be the concealed one under winds and dragons. We have no multiples, so I think maybe picking something where news is single. So we have eight, one, three, five, six, two, five. What about little odds, one, three, five with news? We have no gaps, one, three, five with news. That would be the concealed hand under odds. Let's pick that hand, no gaps. All we need to do is get jokers, ones, fives, and a three. So let's pass one of each suit. Actually, let's give up a dragon because I do not want to be left with passing two dragons if we get everything we want. So let's Let's do it like this. Let's look and see what we can do for South.
Wow, look at that. Dragons. If we could get wins, we could play that concealed hand. There is a year hand that uses two dragons. Any two dragon Kongs. We don't have any flowers though, but we do have year tiles. If we get news, I would maybe rather play news concealed with dragons under the wins and dragons category, but we could also maybe play a year hand and use those. There are no other categories except singles and pairs that use multiple dragons. Second hand down under singles and pairs uses two pairs of dragons, but that's evens and we have odds. So I don't think I would pick that hand. I'd say a year hand or wins and dragons. So we're gonna stay adaptive and see what happens. Let's pass one of each suit. Now let's look and see what we can do for West. Single, Joker, single flower, East, dragons, singles, single, four, seven, single, four, eight, singles in cracks. So we have what each suit represented, no multiples. So this is when you wanna look for a repeating pattern or a predominant pattern and pick a category that uses most of your tiles. I think consecutive run four, five, six, seven. There are consecutive run hands that use opposite dragons. Two, fourth one down and fifth one down. fours. We do have eights. Maybe five, six, seven, eight would be better than fours. Five, six, seven, eight. There is the fifth hand down. Five, six, seven, eight, and then dragon. So let's keep the bigger numbers. Five through eight. Now, we need to give up some tiles here because we have like numbers. That's almost as bad as passing a pair. So I would not do that. The only time I would consider it is if I know what hand I'm playing and I have no gaps. Here, we don't even know what hand we're playing. So I would not do that. We're gonna have to drill this and find some discards here, at least one. Five, six, seven, eight, dragon. Five, six, seven, eight, dragon. Really, the nine probably can go. Just use a process of elimination with your options and then get rid of a tile. When you have a pass, you can stop. You don't have to keep agonizing over what you're gonna do. Just come up with a pass and stop there because the next pass that comes in could totally change your plan. So once you have a pass, you can stop. Stop the analyzing, then wait and see what you get, and then reassess. So let's look and see what we can do for North. Whoa, no multiples. When I have this many jokers, I think about quints. I wonder if we can force a quint. We do have four, six, eight, four, I think that is probably a pretty strong pattern. Four, six, eight evens. If they fill in, we could do consecutive. Let's play two, four, six, eight category and pass those three. We could maybe do like numbers We've got fours, both fours. So let's keep the four. We could maybe make this pass better by passing the four, but I wanna leave my options open. If we pair up, we'll reassess. So let's not make any more choices. Let's just pass those. 
So we're ready for the Charleston. East passes to south. South to west, west to north, and then north down to east. We picked a hand, one, three, five. So we didn't get any keepers. We have all odds. Let's put it even in there. Two, nine, seven, two, nine, six. All right, that's not bad, I guess. This pass is pretty bad. But maybe we'll get another tile we can give up later. Okay, here we're looking for year tiles. We did get a dragon. We're going to keep it. We'll pass those three. We got a keeper. Five, six, and a keeper. Seven. Five, six, seven, eight, green. Five, six, oh, we don't need that. <clears throat> Five, six, seven, eight, we got a gap, green. This would be the fifth hand down. Fifth hand down under consecutive run. So let's pass those three. We got a four. Two, four, six, eight, or like numbers with fours. Oh, we got an east. Let's look at the news concealed hand under evens. Two, four, six, eight in dots. The twos are a pung, so we could maybe use these. Let's focus on two, four, six, eight with news concealed. We won't need the flower. All right, we're ready, ready for the next pass. So east and west pass and north and south we got a keeper and it's the pair that's nice so now we need to pass four eight three i think no matter how you slice that it'll have the same risk because we're gonna mix suits and three fourths consecutive. If we put a seven in there, maybe that's a little better because the three from the seven is pretty far. Let's pass that. We were looking for year tiles and we got one. A multiple though. I don't know if we can use a multiple. I think we just need the year. So we're looking for really a two bam, two crack, one crack. Let's pass one of each suit. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight dot is what we really want, and flowers. We need a pair of flowers and a green dragon. We did pick up a six, five, six. We could, if we get seven bam, we could maybe go with this instead. Let's go ahead and pass that. We got a keeper, an eight. Oh, oh. We went to cross. I don't know if I would pass a flower. These could be the twos though. We're two away, really three away because we need a six. Okay, let's do first left we're going to have them pass one blind so east passes to north north passes to west and they're going to pass one blind west passes to south and south to east anytime someone passes blind that's a red flag that they're close or they can't decide what they're going to do there may maybe between hands here we know what we're gonna play. News with two, four, six, eight. We have a gap of no twos, but we have all these jokers. All we need is a six, a north, and a west. No keepers. We got a keeper. 
We have options. Let's pass those three, one of each suit. Five, six, seven, we want an eight dot. Let's take that out. Oh, I passed like numbers. How did I do that? Oh, that was, I think that was a blind pass. That's something that happens. That's like a risk that you take because you don't know what you're passing. We ended up passing like numbers. Okay, so either way, this is going to be risky. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, wait. Yeah, this didn't fill in. We need an eight dot. No keepers. Okay, now we are ready to do second left. So everybody's ready to pass. Now this player, they have to decide if they want to push through into this next Charleston. Here's the challenge. They have to pass a flower if they continue. They're three away from a concealed hand. If they get everything they want in the next pass, they'll have to break up their hand. If they do not get what they want, they can move it along and benefit from the final two passes. Here's when I would risk passing a flower. We, we want to try to get a two dot or a six dot to further strengthen this hand. So we're going to push forward and pass a flower. This is a rarity, but we have no gap. Well, we do have a gap, but we have jokers and we can use the jokers for this concealed hand. We know what hand we're playing. So I would risk passing a flower to try to get closer with a two dot or a six dot, or maybe even a north and a west. So we're going to keep going. So east is going to pass to north, north to west, west to south, south to east. No keepers. No keepers. We got a flower. This is why you don't want to pass flowers. We need an eight dot and a green dragon. Oh, too bad that wasn't a six. No keepers, but now we can pass for the, uh, the cross pass. So they made it through that critical second pass. Now they have tiles they can pass. So east and west. North and South. Whoops. No keepers. Goodness. We already have a nine. We need a two bam or a one crack and then white dragon, red dragon. We got a keeper. Five, six, seven, eight dragon. Okay. Now because we know what hand we're playing, we have a joker for our gap. I might risk passing that white dragon in this case. We'll think about it. No keeper. We're looking for a six dot, two dot, north and west. Okay, now that was second across. Now we're going to do last right. East passes to south, south to west, west to north, north to east. No keepers. No keepers. No keepers. No keepers. We're doing optional cross. I guess they did pass that dragon. So east and west, north and south. We're going to push it forward. No keepers. Keeper. 
we have a nine, but these are stronger as options. We got a five, but we don't need it. We need an eight dot. No keepers, we're done with Charleston. Okay, so we're ready for the next phase of the game. One, three, five concealed with news. Five discards. I'd probably discard the nine first, year tiles. This could be joker bait. So I hold on to dragons for a little while. Wins I tend to get rid of early if I'm not using them, but here we're good to go. Here we're playing the dragon year hand. That is the first hand under the year category. We need flowers. You know what? I probably, if I could get news, might switch to the concealed dragon hand. We'll see. Here we're playing consecutive run, fifth hand down, pair, 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 pung, pung, pair. So we need an eight dot and a green dragon. Three discards. Here we're playing news, two, four, six, eight, three discards. So we're ready to go. We're going to discard nine crack. We'll use this to mark whose turn it is. Six crack. Let's get rid of the year tile. Nine dot. Four bam. Year tile, one dot. Three bam. We don't need a pung. We've got a pair in here and that's what the hand we picked. Let's keep it just in case we have to switch though, if this goes down, but all our pair and singles are accounted for. So I don't think that's going to happen. Let's discard the eight crack. We could always use jokers. Let's draw south. I want to keep that in case we can do that concealed hand using all the dragons. Let's discard six bam. Four crack, we need an eight dot, a green dragon. Seven bam. Oh, that would have been good joker bait, but I already threw it. Once it's named or hit the table, it's a discard, so you can't go back. We're gonna draw. One bam, that is a keeper. Let's get rid of this red dragon now. And this player's not ready for it. One, two, zero, one, nine with dragons. All we need is a flower there. Let's go ahead and, and commit to that a little. We can wait a little bit. So we're going to need a joker here. Let's get rid of the six crack. That year block is taken care of now. If we can get a flower, that would be good. So six crack was discarded. This is pair pair. So we're good there. We need an eight dot. Nope. Three crack. Seven crack. I should have thrown that four bam or seven bam. Those were already discarded. Flower. We do not need that. Let's get rid of the five dot. Two crack. We don't need it. Let's get rid of one bam. Two dot. This is concealed. Five crack. North. We got that covered. One crack. Let's get rid of nine bam. If we switch to news with dragons, we would have joker bait. Let's draw. 
7 bam. Eight crack. Let's get rid of, I did say it. It even touched the table. West, we already have it. Four dot. This is concealed. Six bam. Two bam, wrong suit. Let's get rid of the seven bam. Nobody wanted that. That was the last pick from the second wall. Everybody should know what category they're in. Here we're playing odds, year, consecutive run, evens. Three dot. I want to hold that flower for a while. Maybe we can get a joker if we hold it. Someone will maybe put out a exposure with a joker. One dot. That's not helpful. I would love to get news so we could use all these dragons. Let's draw. West. Eight bam. Four bam was discarded. Let's throw that. Eight dot, four bam. Six dot. Two crack. Nine dot. Eight dot, joker bait. Let's get rid of the flower. Nine crack. Wow. There are no hands that use multiples on near tiles for this mock card. So we're going to get rid of this. One crack. Three dot. Six bam. Let's get rid of this year tile. Two dot uh, bam. Two bam. It's this player's turn, but I just want to point something out. All these gaps. That is not a good habit. When you play live, have all your tiles together. Because people can tell or can assume right or wrong what your discard count is. So for example, here we might think they have a discard with joker bait. Here, discards with potential. Discards, discards. So try not to have gaps. For the videos I do for teaching purposes. Playing live, keep them together. That is my recommendation and most teachers will share that as well. So we're going to draw Joker. Oh, we can use that here. We can use it either way, really. Three bam. We're going to hold this Joker bait to the, towards the end of the middle game, which is the third wall. Four bam, that's been discarded. We need an eight dot or a joker. We got the joker. Let's get rid of eight bam. Three dot. Three crack. East. Oh my goodness, I would be tempted here to play news with dragons concealed. Let's throw two crack. We'll see. 
9 dot. We need an 8 dot drawing here. One crack. Eight bam. Nine bam. White dragon. We really don't need that. Here we're not ready to take it. And we're kind of in between hands. If we use it for the year, we wouldn't want to call it. We need a two dot. Five, bam. They need that. Two dot. Up here, that's concealed. Two crack, joker bait. If we switch, let's get rid of nine crack. flower. We only need a pair. Let's get rid of it now. Two dot. Oh, we got it. We could maybe use that there. Let's get rid of this three crack. We need the wins very badly. So right now we've got the twos. We got the eights. We need a six dot, a north and a west. We have two more picks east. Two more picks in the middle game. Two bam. Four crack. Eight crack. We're heading towards the end of the middle game. Eight bam. Let's wait one more pick and then we'll get rid of our joker bait. Let's draw. Two bam. Nine bam. Nine dot. We're gonna, this is the, their last pick in the third wall. They got a flower. They don't need it. Let's get rid of joker bait though. We don't want to hold on to that tile going into the fourth wall. So eight dot was discarded. We're going to pung with jokers. It's a little risky, but they, their hand is set. We need that dragon though. Let's discard. You have to play as if you don't know what's in all these players' hands or you'll skew the game. So we're playing as if we don't know. So we threw a seven crack, it's this player's turn. Last tile, third wall. Flower, we don't need it. So we're gonna discard. Everyone should know what hand they're playing. Concealed, little odds. We're in between the year hand with dragons or news with dragons. I would probably throw this next. Here we're playing the fifth hand down under consecutive run. Here we're playing the news concealed hand. I think we have one discard, one discard, really more like three discards here, three or four, depending on which way we go. Probably four discards. Here we have one discard two discards. If you're four discards or fewer at the end of the middle game or beginning of the fourth wall, play to win. But if you have more than four discards, you might consider folding and pushing for a wall game. Joker bait worked in this case. Exchange, please. Thank you. We're going to keep it. Okay. We need that here. 
one three five news we need more <laughs> let's get rid of the six spam six dot five dot five dot eight crack oh we need to get rid of that flower five bam okay they need jokers three dot no dragons are oh there's only one dragon out so this player's got to be thinking someone's holding dragons it's too late to switch their hand though unless they play news which i probably would get rid of these because these have been discarded these are all safe i probably would do that one crack oh let's let's oh i said it and i touched the table we got to discard we'll get rid of the flower next south we already have it south red dragon let's get rid of the five crack three bam flower we're oh, gonna get rid of that two dot this is concealed one bam we need to probably get rid of those dragons. Joker. We don't need it though. This is Pung, Pung, single news. We have one north. One north is out. One west is out. We need, or two wests are, let's see. Yeah, two wests are out. One north and two west. Let's just hold it. I wonder, I wonder if we can actually switch. Well, let's get rid of these. Six bam. We'll just hold it and see. I just wonder if we could switch to all two, four, six, eight in one suit. Since these are not coming in. It may be just too late for them. Let's draw. Five dot. Oh, I keep forgetting to discard that flower. Seven crack. Two bam. Oh, I need to get rid of those dragons. Seven crack. Okay, we're going to discard that flower. Flower. <laughs> You don't want to hold on to those for too long in case someone's waiting on it for a pair. Let's draw. Same thing with dragons. Four crack. Seven bam. Let's get rid of these dragons. They're not ready. We got the west. Oh my goodness. Let's get rid of that eight bam oh man okay we still have work to do though we need a six dot okay let's see one two there's one more six dot there's one more six dot this is going to be tight because we still need a north and that six dot there are two six dots out so that is very tight five bam oh my goodness let's throw one dot they're ready to win on a five bam or a one bam north they got their north oh let's get rid of this two crack okay we could play that news hand if we can get a joker for this red and the west they're still kind of in between four dot 
They could not get the uh, green dragon, of course, because we know where it is. Seven dot. Let's pung. They could get it. They're ready to win on that green. Seven bam. Ready to win on a green dragon. Drawing up here. One dot. Seven dot. Nine crack. Nine bam. Three crack. North. They're not ready. Pung, they needed that six. White dragon. Let's discard nine crack. They have two discards and no more picks. Flower. Ooh. Flower. I think I'd rather throw a green dragon. Either way, it's risky. Flower, dragon, there are no green dragons out. There's no way they can win. We're going to break this up. So five crack was recently discarded. We're going to discard that. Six crack, they can't win. We're throwing a dragon, I mean a joker. Six dot, no winner, joker. Okay, we had a wall game. They were ready to win, two away. They were actually ready to win, but we broke it up because we have risky tiles. They were one away. Everybody was very close. Each of these styles has benefits and liabilities. Each can be successful with the right decision making at the right time. If you have a set of tiles at home, do random pulls to practice finding the strength in a drawn hand. When you're comfortable with that skill, do Charleston modeling and practice each of these styles. Pick a style and play live or online. Try each one and then pick the style that's most comfortable for you. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do, that way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.